Why is Uri Slavkovsky currently playing in the NHL? I do not think he's ready at all yet. And it's been proven these past couple of weeks. The past dozen games that Slavkovsky has played, there's been like maybe one game that he was impressive. And the rest, he looks like he has no place in the lineup. I know the team sucks right now. The Montreal Canadiens are god-awful. He doesn't always get the best line mates. He doesn't always get the best chances or opportunities. But keeping him in the NHL at this point is just useless. I would much rather send him down to Laval, which they should have done at beginning of the season. Sure, he has a couple goals. He has a couple points. There's a lot of promising aspects to his game in which we've seen in the first half of the season. But there's a lot that needs to be fixed. The reason why I think we chose Slavkovsky is because he's a project. When you look at his stats in like the TPS Turku League, sorry, I butchered that so badly. But yeah, you look at the stats there, there's nothing impressive. And then you look at his Olympic stats, those are pretty impressive. But there was just such a small sample size from what we got from Slavkovsky in his draft year and the years before that he's a project. He has the tools to become a player like Rantanen or one of those top 10 wingers in the league. And that's why he's a project. He has the hands, he has the size, he has decent vision, and he if you put them all together, he could become a really insane player. But send this guy to Laval. Why are we rushing him into the NHL? During the preseason, during the Habs camp, he was probably not even a top five player. There were a couple players that deserved an NHL spot to start the season over him. Some of those players are actually doing really well in the World Juniors, aka Mashar. And the other one is Owen Beck, who I think could have easily taken like Jake Evans' spot. You know, he's just like Jake Evans already at a younger age. But yeah, what I'm saying here is he wasn't the best player in the camp. He didn't look like he was NHL ready at all. And he still got the spot. And he still doesn't look NHL ready. We should have sent him down to Laval to start. Let him marinate down there. Pick up the little skills that he's not doing here in the NHL. He'll get way more time, more power play time, more time with the puck on his stick, which is crucial in development. And don't even get me started on the World Juniors. I don't know why we did not send him. It was a huge mistake. It could have been a crazy experience for him. He could have probably even helped Team Slovakia eliminate Team Canada the other night. That was a very close game. And who knows, maybe Team Slovakia would not be eliminated right now if Slavkovsky was sent there. But yeah, it would just be way better for his experience, way better for his development. He's still a super young player. I'm not giving up on this guy yet. Nowhere near that. Players like Tage Thompson, he was dog shit for the first couple of years. And look at him now. One of the best players in the NHL this season. Absolute crazy turnaround. So I'm not going to give up on Slavkovsky. Nowhere near that step. But man, are we not taking this the right way to start? I think we could be making way better moves. I don't think he deserves to be in the NHL right now. I think he should work for it. Like I said, during the camps, he wasn't the best player. He got gifted an NHL spot just because he was the first overall. There were players that deserved that spot way more than him. I just think that some Laval time would be excellent for him. I mean, look at what some AHL time did to Juracek. He's crazy right now. Even Wright was not playing very good in his first couple of games in the NHL. And then he had a little stint down in the AHL, scored a couple goals, and he's looking pretty solid now. Not the best tournament for him. I think he could be a little better. But, you know, the AHL time did him some good. As for Logan Cooley, pretty sure he's still in college, but that's doing him some good. He's tearing it up in the World Juniors. Anyways, just these kids that got drafted around him are just looking way more promising at the moment and I think that's because they're not rushing them their teams are not rushing their development they're taking the right steps by not putting them in the NHL right away and I think uh, it's time to send Slavkovsky down it's never too late put him down there let him get some top time top power play time let him get his groove going and I think all will be all right I think he could easily fix his little mistakes that he's been doing they're very fixable he just needs time to work on them, and Laval is where he should be. If it were up to me, I would send him to Laval until the deadline. When the trade deadline comes, then I'll bring him back up, because, you know, we're going to be shipping off some players, and there's going to be some spots opening. Maybe by then, he'll be a completely different player. 
He's going to pick up on some things that he didn't over the past half season here in the NHL. And maybe he'll just play way better, get better minutes here in the NHL, and he'll be more ready for them when that comes. So I'm not a coach, but that is just my opinion. And yeah, I'd love to hear your opinion down in the comments below. Let me know if I'm just crazy or if you agree with me. I'd love to hear your point of view. And with that being said, that's going to be all for today. So I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Take care.